hello everyone this is sam uh, in this video i gonna show you how to create a dynamic photo gallery in flash using action script 3.0 and xml okay uh, before that we need uh, xml file so first uh, first i want to show you how to create a xml file for this okay so i'm using notepad to create my xml file you can use any text editor okay uh, every XML file should start with question mark XML and version should be 1.0 and encoding is UTF minus 8 and question mark close okay this line should be same for all XML file okay save this file photo gallery dot xml okay the extension is very important okay now i am going to create a node okay so gallery is my root node close the node okay so inside this i have photo node okay then create uh, sub nodes for the photos okay so every photo have url so my url similar to like similar to one dot jpg like this okay so url and second one is name so name you can give any name description so this is all you have to do okay so then copy these photo tag uh, and paste it here I'll paste it for four times okay just change the URL one from two so so change everything one to two okay this is image two you can add your own description and name and whatever it is okay so for the simplicity i am doing like this okay okay finally save this one and close okay so then the next step is you have to set the images so go to the folder okay so in, inside this folder i have 10 images see the properties of the images so the dimension of the image is 1366 into 768 so i don't need this much of dimension so i want to reduce this one so uh, you can use some software to reduce the dimension okay I am using easy thumbnail software okay you can see the description to download the software okay so okay photo gallery images so I want to set the output folder so my output folder should be flash tutor photo gallery ok inside this i want to create a new folder img ok so with this 550 and uh, it is 300 ok now click make all so in images created you can see all these images here okay now see the properties of the images okay the dimension is changed to 550 into 300 okay so I want thumbnails for the images okay so go to the software again and uh, set the thumbnail size to 
25 ok then uh, set the output folder ok I'm going to create new folder I'm sorry thumbs ok so make all so now you can check thumbs folder and go to the properties of the major and you can see the dimension is 125 into 75 ok now all the arrangements are done uh, in the next video I will show you the remaining part to design uh, dynamic photo gallery in flash using action script 3.0 and xml thanks for watching the video thank you